Hello, welcome to Museum Conservation Services Limited. We're going to show you how we're removing pressure sensitive tape from the back of this Russian poster using the Conservation Workstation from Preservation Equipment Limited. The unit comes with a hot air blower and a heated spatula. The blower has three detachable nozzles, the flat one which is very useful for tape and a couple of reducing nozzles, one with a slight curve in it. The heated spatula, this one has this head on it but I think there are other heads available as well. Now the unit, you can turn on either the hot air blower or the heated spatula or both. You can adjust the temperature with this control and put it down again if you wish. The hot air blower has a speed control for the fan so you can have it going very fast or somewhere in the middle. You can switch very easily from the fan to the heater spatula and back again with the set button and it keeps running until it's got down to a reasonable temperature. So we're just going to show the unit in action. Here we go. As soon as you pick it up it starts heating up and I'm starting to warm the tape here and as the tape warms up the adhesive softens and you can peel it away. Sometimes it takes a little while to soften. So let's try some tweezers now. You see that as it warms up it starts to go quite quickly. So there we go. Now my colleague is going to show you the use of the heated spatula for removing tape. So we've preheated it and he's taking the tape off the back of a large colour lino cut print by Edward Borden. It's coming up nicely. You can see it's quite quick. It's a second or two per centimetre. There's not a lot of heat going into the paper. If necessary, you can apply the heated spatula through a layer of silicone release paper. But this is only very, very light. It's not going to polish the surface of the paper or anything like that. It's leaving a slight sticky residue. But that can be removed with a crepe square or with some appropriate solvent.